Good morning, world. I'm back again. The truth. My topic of the day is... Apartments is not for permanent staying. I'm going to get straight to it. Look at all these apartment buildings out here. Look at all these apartments. The reason why I'm coming up with a topic like this, because in New York City, it was designed for you not to own anything. They just basically want you to rent everything. You heard? Look at all these apartments. New York City, Bronx, New York is where I'm at right now. They got so many apartment buildings. All this is temporarily staying, living, or whatever the case may be. It's nothing permanent. It could get to the point they don't want you as a resident anymore. What you going to do about it then? You know what I'm saying? When you putting your all into something that's temporarily. These apartments are temporarily. I've been living in apartments since I was a kid. Good morning. From 1980 until 2004. And then from 2004, I was living in Long Island for eight years in a house. Then I moved back 2012, back to an apartment. So, I already experienced living in an apartment living in a house. Know what I'm saying? None of them places that I was speaking about is mine. But one thing I could say, I did buy two houses in Pennsylvania and they are mine. Not apartments, two houses. Know what I'm saying? So, it's designed for you to um, keep constantly paying the landlord. You basically ain't um um you ain't benefiting from it besides paying your rent and living there. It ain't benefiting you not one bit. Because guess what? If you don't have no money for the rent, guess what? They doubling that shit. Then they're going to keep doubling it till they get to the point that they're going to take you to court and they don't want you as a resident. You know what I'm saying? Look. New York City. New York City. All these fucking apartments. All these apartments out here. And there's millions of people out here. That's why these landlords could do what, whatever they want to do. Because they know you need them. They know you need a place to stay. You know what I'm saying? But the thing about it, if you start working on to better yourself and benefit yourself and make sure you have your own property, then they don't have nothing to say. They'll look at you like, 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 you the problem. But you just happen to be smart about it and came to your senses knowing that that shit ain't right. So the moral of the story is invest in a house. You know what I'm saying? Even if you got to pay monthly payments. You know what I'm saying? My suggestion is buy foreclosed homes because it's way cheaper and you could customize your house the way you want it. Yeah, you gotta fix it up, yeah. That, that's why I said customize. You could take a house that nobody living in and you could turn that into a mansion for cheap. You know what I'm saying? 
Nobody ain't gonna tell you the blueprint, but hey, I'm the truth. I don't mind sharing some personal information, you heard? Touch down. And um look, all these apartments. 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 All this is temporarily staying. It wasn't designed for you to live forever, for you to own the apartment out here. It was meant for you to rent until you die, until you decide to move. People think I got a lot of money. I don't have nothing. Whatever I had, I happen to be smart with it. And I suggest you do the same thing when you happen to get some money. Be smart about it. And keep people out your circle because everybody's not in for your best interest. A lot of people wouldn't give a fuck about you. You know what I'm saying? I learned that the hard way. But it wasn't designed for you to um, be living in these apartments forever. It wasn't designed that way. But they getting paid all around. That's why it becomes some slum laws, because these niggas ain't doing their job no more. You heard? Yeah. Good morning. How you doing? Good morning, hey. It's set up that way. You know what I'm saying? Investing in a house. I'm like, the only location I know where you could get a house for cheap is Pennsylvania. You could get a house for 3900 out there. A foreclosed home. And then and then people probably like, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm um I'm, I'm, I'm not doing that. 3900 compares to people rent out here. People paying 700 to $2000 a month out here. So, you paying 3400 and if your rent is 2000 a month, you basically got two months rent for a permanent house. But people don't want to live, leave New York City. I love New York City. I will always love New York City. But know what I'm saying? I don't got to be out here for the rest of my life. It's getting to the point that ain't shit out here no more. And people don't seem to realize that. I guess people sticking around to see something will happen to make it better. Ain't nothing happening. This fucking city is whack. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I got an apartment in the Bronx, but I also got two houses in Pennsylvania. So obviously I'm doing something smart. I'm renting and I'm owning. You know what I'm saying? So whatever I don't do out here in the Bronx, I do that out there in Pennsylvania because that's my house. This is not my apartment. Yes, I could get kicked out. Yes, if they don't want me as a resident, yeah, they could try to kick me out, but they gotta have proof. But the thing about it, they don't got proof. So it makes you feel very uncomfortable knowing that your landlord wanna kick you out because you asking for another apartment. So that's how that happened with me. I'm not gonna keep asking for an apartment. I bought two houses. I'ma just fix my houses up and live in them shits. Cause there's nothing like your own, you know what I'm saying? That's all I gotta say about that. These apartments, look. These apartments. These apartments is meant for you to be temporarily. So don't get too comfortable trying to own a block that's not yours. Get your own property and claim that shit. That's all I got to say about that. Good day. God bless. Peace.